Walmart was apologizing on Monday after the appalling product description was placed on the giant retailer's website. The retailer was slammed after the color of a netting weave cap, which is this thing you put on your head that goes between your scalp and the extensions that people buy to make it look like they have hair. I have no idea why people would use those, by the way. Anyway, the, ex the description of the product was described as the color nigger brown. Of course, people on the internet went a little hysterical with this. They were very upset. It started the trending of the word hashtag boycott Walmart. Uh, hey, Walmart, what are you doing? Twitter user Kawani Lunas tweeted with a screenshot of the problematic item. New York Times bestselling author Roxane Gay condemned the retail chain, tweeting that dropping the end bomb on their website was just totally unacceptable. Shortly after the controversy erupted, Walmart removed the racial slur and replaced the add to cart button with the message saying the product was no longer available. Walmart, under the pressure, released this message. They said, while we aim to produce or provide accurate product information, it's provided by our manufacturers, suppliers, and others, and has not been verified by us. A Walmart spokeswoman later apologized in a statement released to the New York Post. We're very sorry and appalled that this third-party seller listed their item with a description on our online marketplace, said spokeswoman Denise Marquart. It is a clear violation of our policy and has been removed, and we are investigating the seller to determine how this could have happened. Let's put a finer point on all of this. We don't care about what China said on your website. We care about jobs in the U.S. for people who need them. That should be the real point. That's all that really matters. So you know what? Forget this issue. How about you bring those jobs home? How about you have manufacturing with black companies locally? How about that? How about we do that? How about that be a mandate of Walmart? Create some businesses. See, if we focus on the N-word and they send the jobs overseas, basically they are calling us N-words without saying it. And that's the type of racism we have in America. The type of racism where you call the N-word without them even saying it. <laughs> God, please, no! No!